Resistors are available in several series, which uh, series are fixed values. And here I got some series like E6, E12, and E24 based on the tolerance. And uh, there are four, there are few many series available as well, which is after E24 there is like E48 E48 series and E96 series and E192 series So based on the tolerance like E6 series has like plus minus 20% tolerance and E12 has plus minus 10% of tolerance and E24 has plus minus 5% of tolerance where E48 has plus minus 2% of tolerance and E96 has plus minus 1% of tolerance and E90, E192 series has plus minus 0.5% of tolerance. Suppose you you have a resist resistor of suppose you have a resistor of value value of 100 ohm and it has a tolerance for like plus minus 10 percent so the actual value can be stay in the in 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 the range of 90 ohm to 110 ohm but if you need more accurate value so you have to choose like the closer tolerance one like if you if you want to if you want to get the accurate one so choose like closer like if you have a register of 100 ohm the tolerance is like one percent and then the value can be stay in 99 ohm to 100 and one ohm so which is more accurate you can get the more accurate value if you choose one percent tolerance one So in that case you can use like E96 series which has like 1% tolerance. Now we are going to see how to find the tolerance. Suppose you have a resistor the marked value of the resistor is 220 ohm but you find this value in the multimeter which is like 212 ohm so in that case what's the tolerance so to find the tolerance so the tolerance is tolerance tolerance equal to
error divided by the mark below times 100 so in that case the error is error 200 220 minus 212 so error is 220 minus 212 which is 8 so if I want to measure the tolerance for this found value register the it will be error is 8 and the mark value is 220 times 100 where it is if you do the calculation using calculator that will be 3.63 percent so it's below five percent so that's how you can find the tolerance so how do you choose your required register value for your specific circuit diagram for example you have a 9 volt battery and you want to connect a LED and this LED can take only 20 milliampere so the 9 volt battery you connect with this resistor and you want to find the value for this resistor and its tolerance as well and what type of resistor you have you need to use so it's very simple so we know we, we need to pass only 20 milliampere current and then using the ohms law V is equal to I R so we need to find the value of R R is equal to V by I which is 9 volt and ampere is 20 milliampere so this is you can write 9000 divided by 20 volt by ampere so 900 divided by 2 which is 450 ohm so you need a value of resistor is which is 450 ohm so for nearest value of 450 you can you can choose from this series e6 series or you can choose from e12 series or you can choose from e24 series so if you don't care about the tolerance you can you can choose any of them so if you like choose like 
E6 series which is 20% plus minus 20% of tolerance so in that case like 450 ohm plus minus 20% of tolerance so the current in that case the current I will be maximum 20.93 and the minimum will be is max and the minimum current will be 9.15 which is minimum they all are they all are milliampere so in that case the maximum current will be 20.93 milliampere and the minimum current will be 9.15 milliampere power calculation so now we have to calculate the power so we know the power equation p is equal to iv so our found the current was the maximum was 20.9 milliampere and the minimum was 9.15 milliampere so in both case we we can calculate the power so for the maximum current the power is equal to 20.9 milliampere times our v was 9 volt which is which is hundred and eighty eight point ten million milliwatt so we see this is like below point to what so we just find the appropriate appropriate uh, the series for this register or appropriate type of register I think the carbon film and metal film register should be all right for this purpose let's have a look in this chart here its charts is for different types of registers characteristic chart so we have got 0.2 watt which is calculated and then we can actually use for 0.2 watt we can use this three types of resistors which all are like less than less than 2 watt so we can use carbon film resistor metal film re resistor also metal oxide resistors so let's see another example let's see another example where we have 24 volt battery and then we need to draw 20 milliampere of current and 
what will be the value for r so the same way like uh, for finding the r we know the ohm's law v equal to i r so so from here r equal to v by i where v equal to 24 volt i we need 20 milliampere so r is equal to Twelve, twelve hundred ohms. Twelve hundred ohms, which is like one point two kilo ohm. So we need one point two k resistor to draw 20 milliampere current so if we want to use like plus minus 5% of tolerance resistor so let's have a look the series for series 1.2 K resistor so we for 5% tolerance 1.2 K value which is like E24 series so this series has plus minus 5% tolerance so if we use this series and then we have we use this plus minus 5% tolerance resistor so in that case uh, we can get the maximum current maximum current i is equal to v by r where v is 24 volt and r is 1200 maximum current will be where the maximum current will be minus 5 24 volt 1100 and 95 uh -huh. the maximum current will be in that case 24 divided by 1195 which is like 20.08 milliampere and the and the minimum current will be so 24 volt divided by 1205 ohm 19.9 19.9 19 point, almost 19.92 milliampere so in that case we can calculate the power as well so 20.08 milliampere and 19.92 milliampere that one was the 
max current and that one was the min minimum current so in that case we if we calculate the power the power p is equal to iv for the maximum current 20.08 into 24 volt which is that's milliampere which is four hundred and eighty one point nine two so almost four hundred and eighty two milliwatt so and so the maximum for the maximum current the power is 482 milliampere and then for minimum current that one will be 19.92 milliam sorry times 24 volt which is 478.08 which is almost 478 milliwatt so minimum 478 milliwatt and then maximum 482 milliwatt so let's have a look the characteristic chart then we can find which types of resistors actually fit in this circuit diagram So from this characteristic chart of different types of resistors we can actually see that for 482 milliwatt 482 milliwatt so we can use actually this resistor carbon film resistor uh, which is like 0.4 watt but there is like 2 watt maximum 2 watt is 0.5 so little bit over power resistor should be used so we can actually use this carbon film resistor because it's the power is 0.4 milliwatt so maximum 0.4 milliwatt and maximum minimum also 0.4 milliwatt so that's how we can choose our appropriate register for our required circuit diagram